Hello friends, welcome to Ultra Pixels. If you like our channel, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe and press the bell icon for getting further notifications. Hi friends, this is a 24 inch Sony LED TV. Here the complaint is no display due to internal shorting inside the glass panel. Here you can see this is the model number 24P412B. In this TV, the complaint is no display. Now the TV is turned on. Here you can see the backlight is working properly. Here the complaint is with the display due to internal shorting. So now let's check the basic panel voltages. While checking, we found that the 12 volt input VCC is present. But 3.3, EVDD, VGH, VGL, like all basic voltages are missing from the panel. Please watch the complete video without skipping for getting more information about this panel repairing. This is a Inolux panel. See friends, in this panel, actually the DC to DC IC goes to protection mode because of widget shorting inside the glass panel. So, it's a common fault in this particular model TV. To remove this shorting, we need to cut down the widget track. So, the line marked is the widget track. So, to remove shorting, let's cut down this widget track first. See friends. Now we cut down the VGH track entering to the panel. See friends, here the VGH track is cut down. Now the panel shorting is removed and the DC to DC IC back to working. See friends, while measuring, now all panel voltages are okay. See, VGH voltage is also there. You can see the VGL voltage is also present. 3.3 voltage is also present. So now the DC to DC IC is working properly. See now all voltages are okay. But in display, you can see a vertical line and vertical bars instead of no display. See friends. Now instead of no display, here you can see the lines appearing on the screen. This is because of the VGH voltage missing. Due to shorting in VGH, we cannot connect the VGH voltage directly. So in this panel to repair, we can implement two methods. The first method is using a step up module or a voltage booster you can connect 17 volt to 30 volt to the VGH test point to the panel side here I implemented the second method the second method is instead of VGH voltage here I bypassed the AVDD voltage to the VGH test point to the panel side here the AVDD voltage is connected to the VGH test point in the panel side here, if we connect the VGH voltage again, then the DC to DC IC will go to protection mode. So, here instead of the VGH voltage, here I used the ABDD voltage. While measuring, here you can see that the AVDD voltage is of 17 volt. See friends.
now let's see the picture at the same time you can see the dc to dc ic is working properly all other vgh vgl voltages are present now the voltages are still okay and the dc to dc ic is working properly so let's check the picture see friends now the picture comes and the tv is repaired successfully here you can see now the display is working properly so here we successfully repaired the tv by removing the vj shorting in the panel now the panel repairing is successfully completed so now let's put the back cover back to tv and put all screws back to the back cover see friends finally here you can see the final result now the tv is working properly see friends now we successfully solved the no display issue on this panel see friends now you can see the result the picture is crystal clear so that's all for today hope you like this video see you in another video with another interesting topics if you like our channel please don't forget to like share subscribe and press the bell icon for getting further notifications thanks for watching